Yeah, let's just candlestick keep. Yeah. We're doing it. Fear of the dark is a normal, so statusless. That is fine. I don't. Yeah, that's actually probably better, so I don't get lit on fire and take substantial damage um, from fire cats or pepper cats or whatever because I have my black cat cow. Normally I break all the books, normally I break all the things. Right now, we're just running. Oh, come on, put the bomb up. Yeah, cats are silly. I'd expect them to have dashed by now, but I guess this is tier one after all. Get out of here. Silly iron buckler. Maybe if we find the room with the Trojan in it, you know? Yeah, I'll skip you. If we find the room with a Trojan in it, I'll take a hit from this Iron Buckler and just see what happens. I'm kind of curious, because it has stun resistance, so it will absorb the damage from the stun as well. Uh, much better than another shield would, where the stun would go through the shield and straight into the defense. Because the status is on shields. Shields can't take status damage, of course, so it absorbs it into the damage that the shield takes. In other words, if you have status resistance towards... Oh, let's just get in there. Okay. Dancing, dancing. Eh. Okay. And onward. If you have status resistance like this one does to stun, then the stun damage that would normally go into the shield's defense gets absorbed by that status resistance. So the stun damage that would normally go into the shield uh, instead... Yikes instead gets absorbed by the status and less so you would take less damage shielding with this than with another one star shield that doesn't have stun resistance this is a prize room let's totally do it yeah wow completely inconsistent absolutely that's how i roll and this is i assume the fastest way to we'll take that we'll get our heat we got things to heat all right oh last stun vial to complete it just so i don't get a file on the prize wheel Strategy, you guys. Pro strats. That's how we do it. More prize room. How about skip this time? It didn't actually look like one of the empty ones, which is a complete ripoff, by the way. I just hate that. No reason to light the candles in here, especially since I'm not fighting. There's going to be a key up here, isn't there? And I'm going to be sad that I'm going to have to carry it all the way back and fight all these howitzers. Yes. We will leave those boxes there. Boxes are great. Let's see what's the best way to do this. Great for howitzer shots. Thankfully, there are fewer howitzers because the candles are here. Sometimes the candles... Okay, in a five... In a tier three situation, hiding behind these boxes is a boon. Here, pointless. Okay, I understand that. I forget that we're actually in tier one. Now I have to carry this thing all the way down. With cats in close, incoming. Okay, we're doing this. Just take damage and get, like, oofed. Stop it! Please, Grimalkin. Please, things... People, stop. Ooh, how did I get past that? Did anything here die? Nothing died. Things are almost dead. We will finish them all off. Stop it. Die. Things. Ow. I'm just taking a ridiculous amount of damage for death five. Oh, but I get some of it back. Just jumping that way so I don't accidentally intercept the bullet because that can happen sometimes. All right, onward and outward. No Trojan. That's unfortunate. Okay, good. We get a. Uh, this was. This is gonna be hard without a gun. Uh, assuming it's one of the normal ones. Yeah, any of them. Most of them are hard with guns. Oh, I forgot to heat anything. Well, that's okay. I, there's no reason to stop. We will roll. Get the dice back on the screen. Roll a gun. Thank you. Roll a one-star gun. That's fine just whatever it takes to blow up some of the explosives in this level um is fine with me i don't actually know the difference between them i think this might be the one with the cats so this if it gets a double level up will increase the de the defense of the shield by about less than 0.33 percent not 0.33 percent there it is oh level 10 iron buckler all right so it's not 0.33 percent stronger that is huge like totally groundbreaking you guys you have no idea same similar concept with the armors just 
don't do it if you don't have to. Armors, you kind of have to, but it doesn't increase the status resistance. If you've got armors like this that are 5 star, 5 star, don't even worry about it. There's a level 1 chaos I've been heating just because, but Mercurial level 3, Snarblax level 4, just don't even waste my 5 star shields. You're wasting fire crystals when you have other things to heat and crystallize. There is just no point. Please don't. It's such a waste. You get next to zero defense about it. It's just for the people that want to, uh, are done with the game and have nothing better to do with their time. That's fine, but especially with the Radiance being rarer, heat your weapons. Heat your obsidian weapons that you have, unless you've already done so, in which case, well, darn. Four is a helm. Four is a level. Helm. Level four. Only one I've got. That's right. I forgot about that. Pull this up. Okay, so that's two. Here's three. Six is a shield. Three is a three-star shield. All right. What do we got? We've got Swift Strike. Oh, absolutely. I would choose that one for a run like this. This is the Barbarous Thorn Shield. So six is a shield which goes to a trinket. Six is a trinket goes to a zero-star trinket. There is no such thing. So we lose that slot. Poof. Roll again. Three is a bomb. Three is a level. <sighs> three star, three star. Super splinter, dark reprisal. Super splinter, dark reprisal. Super splinter, dark reprisal. How about splinter? Just cause. Um, yeah. I think we'll go with that. So one, two, three, four, five slots filled. Five, three more to go. Two is a gun. One is a one star gun. No, please. Shock, absolutely shock. Um, shock over freeze. Especially since I expect to see cats in this level and cats have this innate resistance to freeze where they are extremely vulnerable to shock. It's like they're wearing chaos for shock or something. It's great. So two more to go. I'd like some armor. Why, thank you. You were so kind to give me proto armor. Oh my word, okay. Six is, of course, zero star, so we'll stick with the suit. All right, one more. If it's a weapon, I can't use it. If it's a shield, helmet, or, sh or armor, I can turn it into a trinket. This is gonna become a three star trinket. Because it was a armor, we already have armor, so it pushes into a three star trinket. Redwood bracelet, we're taking it. It's all we got. Ladies and gents, this is kind of, I'm not getting good on the rolls. This is just unfortunate. Oh, there's slimes in this. This is where slimes spawn. Slimes burn easy. Do I want to fight them though? Especially no, not with these weapons. No, 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 no. Though this zapper, oh, and they're freeze anyway, so it doesn't even matter. Ah, it didn't even shock. Oh my word, there is, no, there is no point to this whatsoever. They take so little damage. Uh-oh, what's happening? Oh, okay. Oh, there goes my damage for the level. Oh, and there's my freeze. Come on, I he's got vulnerability to shock. I've got shock. Oh, I don't have freeze resistance. Okay, well, I've already beaten you so far down. Might as well take you out. He didn't get shocked once. Not to say he doesn't have the vulnerability. I don't know if vulnerability, if like saying wearing chaos makes you more likely to get shocked. I'm not sure if that's a thing. Also, the zapper has that mission reward ASI high on it. So that means that uh, this should be firing at maximum speed. This should be maximum. I'm kind of tempted, you know, I got two, this one fires like that too? Yeah, why wouldn't we? Let's totally do that. Let's go to controls, Let's custom, weapon slot two should be tab, weapon slot three should be space. So now we should be able to, oh, it's weapons one and two. Oh, well, I should have just left it be then. So, weapon slot, one is tab, two is space. And so I should be able to... There we go. That's called switching. You use it with alchemers, except apparently you can also use it with these. All right, we are gonna be using the zapper, not the fire, I think. Um, I actually 
the fire might just be more worth it. Oops. Uh, I don't know. Is the fire more worth it? Cats have re has ex have a good resistance to fire. It does damage. I guess we'll throw pots in there when we can. Ugh, are you serious? I should turn auto-target on. Just to make my life easier. Ugh. Botching this. I wonder if this is faster. Eat fire. Oh! Let's do that. That will help. Yeah. Yeah. Get some. Oh my word, this is painful. Yeah, this is what I didn't want to happen, to be completely honest. I knew it could have. I don't know if this is faster than just doing this. Um, does the zapper only shock on charge, or is it just so ridiculously unlikely to charge that it's not even doing anything? I'm, I'm, excuse me. Mr. Cat, I'm trying to shoot you. Please cooperate. Okay, we're going with the auto target. Shift. I have mine bound to shift. Oh my goodness. Is there another way? Okay, thank goodness. Well, we got stuff. Kind of feel like I'm coming after out of a painful solo Vanaduke run on the last room before the boss. Like, give me my things, because I deserve this. Hey, look, more stuff to heat my zapper and my stun gun. This is great. <laughs> really is. For being painful, it's kind of fun. Oh, you're nah. Oh, the bo boxes are dealing elemental damage now. Okay, get, get, move, just move, just move. Okay, now he moves. Okay, we're gonna wait for my shield to charge back up. And if we have to do that again, we'll just shield bash through. It seems like a... Ugh. I'm still gonna take damage. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm gonna escape. No reason to open that whatsoever. Pop that. Um, these jellies are gonna get in the way. Oh, are you gonna make me kill them? Are you serious? Okay, use the mask. There is no reason. I should have brought my dark retribution. I'm so regretting this. I'm like, cats. No, of course not. But it was this level which has. I didn't even think about the fact that it has. Jellies over cats. Okay. This is okay to do You where you can hit the spikes in a uh, tier one. If you happen to get this somewhere else. Goodbye. Like where you run through the spikes and it takes a ton of your health. This is just the worst f way to finish a level where you've already taken a lot of damage. It is awful. I absolutely despise that area. But... Tis what it is. We are not re-rolling on the next level. I don't know if I will ever re-roll. All things considered. It's not supposed to be done, so that's why I'm not getting to it. Uh, no, I'm not even going to stop to heat my stun gun. We're just going to keep going. Thankfully, it is clockworks, so we can run through this probably a little bit faster. That uh, Scarlet Hall should not have been as hard as I made it to be. All right, well, once again, Zapper, apparently awful at delivering shock, but it shocks enemies. Stun Gun is uh, stun. Both of these have the innate UVs that you get from playing the mission system. Super Splinter Bomb, part of the uh, piercing line of the Splinter Bombs, which explodes in the center and then uh, releases shards that go to the outside. The shards deal slightly more damage than the actual center of the bomb, which is not... Yep, there you go, you can see. So the center does 18 the outside does 22 so better to hit with the outside than with the middle but the tendency is that the knockback from the inside will knock them out or you just keep doing this like I'm doing here because zombies are fun I believe I want to say zombies shock well too but I'm not positive on that I know they burn well I don't know if they shock well uh-huh. He drifted right into it. That's like me playing Lockdown. That's like all I do. This zapper is just the worst at actually shocking them. Shock. Shock them. 
it may be because I'm just too far into the clockworks for it to matter anymore, where it just won't do anything straight up. No, not this. Okay, we're just going. Run. Nope. Light zombies, nope. This room, nope. It's actually faster to go on the bottom. There's one less, one less switch to hit, but... You know, whatever. We're out. We're moving on. This is okay with me. By the way, when I propose strange things, like, oh, it would be cool if the game had this. And you say, no, that's a silly idea. It doesn't fit with the lore of the game. Skipping that because it's probably not the exit either. Just remember those danger rooms. There is, think about it. From a lore perspective, is there any reason for those to exist? Spark of life, why thank you. Yes, I'm McBandit. No, gotta go get it. I already said I've gotta go get it. I gotta go get it. Go. Thank you. Yes, warm fire crystals. Ah, feels so good. There's no reason for those danger rooms to exist. Like, why in the clockworks would they be there for any reason whatsoever? And the answer is, they shouldn't be. So, when we say silly on the podcast or otherwise, when we say silly things, like, it would be cool if the game had a re-roll function where I could take these pickups, all the pickups in my near, in the near vicinity using a sprite power or something, and change them into some other thing. Like, pretend they were a prize box and it turns into something else. Could be just another vial, could be fire crystals, or could be crowns or heat. Like, that would be cool. That'd be a f cool sprite effect, especially since you can't drop vials. I would like that. And you could just use it on your client side and it would be great. But it doesn't make any sense. But neither do those danger rooms, so that's my fallback is. Doesn't make sense? Well, neither do the danger rooms, so there. Weird thing about heat, they snap. There is machinery going off in the room, I apologize now, all of a sudden. But yeah, this zapper will be fully heated uh, by when I get to the next thing, even though it doesn't appear to be. Also, these bars don't reflect the 25% plus on the heat. Printer, why you be so silly? Goodness sakes, please stop. Uh, it doesn't reflect the 25% heat, so if I had 25% heat here, it would boost, uh, you'd see it be farther down when I uh, checked it out on the inventory. It took forever to load into this place, goodness gracious. All right, we're just gonna get down to the next level before we continue. This will end off this episode though, so thank you guys for watching, that was kinda silly. Didn't get into the analytics of much uh, but there wasn't much to get into. I've been using one-star weapons. What are you gonna do? Fire really fast. That's what we're gonna do. Whoops. Come on. It's not working. There we go. Alright. We'll end on this. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching. We'll see you next time!